hey guys today we'll be making date powder and we'll be needing only date for it this is the date i'll be need i'll be using two cups of dates you can use any quantity of your choice so the first process is washing it make sure you wash it properly to remove all the deaths in it i haven't even welcomed you guys pardon my manners <laughs> You guys are welcome to the bus kitchen. You're welcome. And if this is your first time of of watching my video, thank you very much. And do not forget to subscribe. Click on the red click on the subscribe button below to subscribe to my channel, please. And also um click on the notification bell to get notified each time I upload new videos. And to my subscribers, oh, I love you guys. You guys are the best you are the best thank you so very much at this point you can pick out the bad ones from the dates and then make sure you wash properly you now then the next thing is to transfer the dates into a spacious tray or bowl or plate next is to de seed the dates so i'll be removing the um, seed from all the dates be careful so you don't cut your hands or you don't injure yourself at this point because some dates are usually strong so you just have to be careful not to injure yourself At this point, I'll just use my hands to break the um, date into smaller pieces. This is to enable it dry very fast and secondly to enable my um, blender crush it very very well. <laughs> Okay, once you're done, use your hands to to um, separate it very well and then put it under the sun to dry properly, like properly. You can as well use a dehydrator to dry it, that's if you have one. But if you don't have, just put it under the sun and cover it with a net cloth or something to prevent flies from perching on it. So after about two days under the sun, my date wasn't still dry to do it. I wanted it because of the weather. So I, I decided to use um, an air fryer to dry it properly. You can as well use a microwave if you have one. Once you bring it out from the microwave or air fryer, it's usually very hot and soft. So what you do at this point is just to keep it for some minutes to get cold and it becomes hard again. Once your date is very dried, put it in a blender and blend till it becomes very smooth. Then the next thing is for you to sieve it. Once you're done sieving, your date powder is ready. You can use it for your baby food, you can use it for your tea, your pap, whatever thing you want to use it for. It's it's healthy and good if you are if you're running away from sugar this is the best option for you thank you thank you for watching